you can build a future value calculator that works with both periodic and single payments using FV function in its full form. Allocate cells for all the arguments including optional arguments like type. Format B2 as percentage. Select B2 and in the home tab in the number group click on percent. Format B4 and B5 as currency. In the home tab in the number group click on the drop down and select currency. Here is syntax for FV function. In F8 enter the FV function in its full form. Define the arguments in order. First argument is rate. It's the periodic interest rate. It is B2 by B7, annual interest rate by periods per year. Second argument is N per, total number of payment periods, B3 star B7, number of years multiplied by periods per year. Third argument is PMT, periodic payment amount. PMT should be a negative number because it represents an outflow. Minus ABS B4. Use the absolute function to get the value entered in B4 without the sign and put the minus sign before the argument directly in the formula. The user can enter positive or negative value and future value is calculated correctly. Fourth argument is PV. Initial investment. PV should also be negative. So use minus ABS B5. Next argument type when payments are due B6 value should be 0 or 1 0 or omitted default regular annuity where payments are made at the end of a period 1 annuity due where payments are made at the beginning of a period here is complete formula to find the future value in 5 years when dollar 5000 is deposited initially and $100 is deposited beginning of every month at annual interest rate of 5%. Enter these values. Annual interest rate 5%. Number of years 5. Periodic payment $100. Initial payment $5,000. 1 for type. 12 for periods per year. Future value is around 13,000. To download practice Excel file, please click on the link in the description. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.